Well, hi there. You may be thinking to yourself, Iska, didn't we just do like a cleaning up your room and redoing your altar video like maybe a month or a month and a half ago? And I would say yes. Yes, stranger on the internet. You are correct. We did. And are you wondering to yourself, Iska, why is your room such a freaking mess again? Well, stranger on the internet, let me tell you, I put in my two weeks notice eight days ago at my pharmacy job. And I'm starting a brand new job as the uh, manager in training at a local small business, which I shall not be naming for obvious reasons. Um, and I'm also still working at that local small bookstore one to two nights a week. So right now, I am currently working one, two, three jobs, plus being a mom, plus having way too many hobbies. <laughs> um, my life is a mess, and until the pharmacy is gone, I have three shifts left at the time of making this video, until that is done, um, I have let my room go. We redecorated it at the beginning of this year that all of you will already know. We finished it in uh, March, and it is now the very end of April. Beltane is upon us. As you can hear, it is grass cutting weather and season. My best friend from Germany arrives in four days. I have work to do. My altar is still decorated for Astara. So are things upstairs in my living room. <laughs> um, I started gardening this week and I just, yeah, I have way too much crap going on in this room. So we need to take care of that or more appropriately, I need to take care of that. Uh, Neil, my husband, and I are brewing kombucha today as well because what else would I do when I already feel slightly overwhelmed with things? Tack on something else. You're right. You're right. However, um, the kombucha brewing process is very slow at the beginning because um, we've already got our scoby, uh, but I needed to make the tea for that kombucha. So 14 cups of water were brought to a boil, then I added one cup of uh, sugar, and then I added in my two tablespoons of loose leaf orange pico tea in a little muslin, or, or I guess cheesecloth bag that I created myself. So that has to come down to room temperature. Neil is out with M right now at Derby. He is getting the store-bought kombucha that we need to use to make like our starter first fermentation with it. So in the meantime, I got some crap to do around here. So I'm going to just sort of let the time lapse do the magic for you so you can see me getting my room back in order. The first thing we're going to do, I did wash and dry my sheets the other day and I made my bed. So that part is done. Do not have to touch the bed except for neatening it up. However, the floors are a disgrace. I should be ashamed of myself. I've also got a whack ton of handknit socks that I need to wash. So I think I'm going to get those off my floor first and get those started so that they can soak and then I can put them out to dry on the deck later. So let's start with that. Then we'll move to um, putting things away that are in this room already and then I will move to grabbing everything that needs to be removed to another location for the end, I'll cut that part out of me walking everything else to all the other rooms in the house. Uh, I will not put that in the video, but yeah, once that's done, I'm going to uh, take all the Ostara stuff off my altar and take some of the stuff off of it. I'm gonna give it a wipe down and then I'm gonna set the altar back up. And then we'll go from there. So come along with me. And if this is inspiring you, to zhuzh up a room, tidy up an area in your house, then by all means, 
use me as your motivation, I'm all for it. If you'd rather just sit and watch or, you know, kind of listen and do something else, go for it. No judgment here. Uh, but this is how I'm spending part of my Saturday. So let's come along.
tired. Yeah, we did a lot, didn't we, Tasha? We made dye for tomorrow. Well, I could probably actually do it today. We washed blankets and clothes and hand knit socks. Put them all in the clothesline or the hand dryer to dry. We cleaned and vacuumed the bedroom, hung a new tapestry, redid the altar, started kombucha. What do you think? Is it time for a snack and some beer and my book? on the deck. I think it might be. I think it just might be. Yeah. I'm happy with all the stuff I got done today. And I hope that you guys enjoyed this little vlog. And I hope that you're all set for Beltane as well. And if you're not, then I hope that this will inspire you to get some of your own stuff done. So, take care guys, and until the next video, be wise, be brave, be magical, and if you're feeling up to it, maybe be a little bit productive. Bye!